What y'all think? Is it ever going to stop? I don't think it's going to. I really, 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 really don't. Ain't no traffic on my street today. Well, it's Saturday. I don't have to work till Monday. That's a good thing. I was going to go to the Dollar Tree and get a few things, but it's still, can y'all see the flurries? It's still flurrying. Ugh. I need it to stop. We've had enough. We have had enough. All right, YouTube, since it's snowing cats and dogs out there, um, I'm going to make some stuffed shells. I got my water boiling. See, they're just like, you know, my Freudian shells, but they're. them to be together. I've already put salt and a little bit of oil in that water so stuff don't stick and they don't boil over. Get in there. Uh, let's see. I don't know how many shells we need. They got to get in the water though. Okay. What do you think? About two or three more? Okay. So let it go ahead and, and let that. I'm going to go ahead and cut this pepper up. I'm not going to use all of it. Well, do we need that much? Uh. I don't think I need a whole pepper. I think, I think, I think that's right there. That's plenty. So, I'm going to sort of, um, cook my hamburger. Almost like I'd be making, um, spaghetti or, you know, how I put onions and peppers in, in all my, in all my, uh, you know, Italian kind of food. Well, let's go ahead and use the rest of this pepper. Go ahead. So what y'all doing today on the snow day? It's Saturday, so kids don't go to school anyway, so I know the kids don't care. <clears throat> Remember when you was little and you'd sit and watch the news in the morning while you was getting ready for school? You'd have to start getting ready because you didn't know. No, if they didn't tell you the night before. Alright, so, let's go ahead and get the hamburger in there. I'm just using cheap hamburger from Walmart. 73 lean, 27% fat, but you know what? It's like almost $4. It's a little less than $4. Let me turn around a little bit. I'm still in my pajamas looking like who done it and what the heck for. I don't care. I re I'm not getting dressed today. I am not getting dressed today. I could care less. Nowhere to go. Okay, so I'm just putting my hamburger in the in the pan. So let's go ahead and put those peppers in there. Can't do nothing, can't go nowhere. Um, I keep on saying I'm going to go eat a Sam's hot dog, but, um, but I'm not getting out that snow today, so I'm not. I don't know. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and season up my beef. I'm going to take that salsa dressing. I have to shake all day. Same with the pepper. With the pepper, and I like a lot of pepper. You know that I bought this pepper. It was four dollars. Four dollars. Can you believe that? 
when did pepper get four dollars and uh i just i've heard everybody talk about smoked paprika smoked paprika well i finally got some now i know why they're talking about it it's i would generally i would have put garlic in this but um I don't know. I guess it's old age or something. I can't eat garlic. It tears me up. Oh, boy, does it tear me up. So, um, I know that I still get, like, a little garlic, like, when I use a can, like, say, I'm going to use, but I don't get the garlic kind anymore. I don't get, you know, where it says garlic on the front. I know there's some garlic in there, but I think as long as I don't have a whole lot of garlic, it don't bother me too bad. But if I like cut up fresh garlic, or I used to use the kind in the jar, you know, the kind that's already minced for you. Um, but uh, it just tears me up, so so I don't eat garlic anymore. Let me go ahead and cover that so it don't just splatter everywhere. Um, let's see. I'm not gonna put any onion powder or anything in there. I got plenty of onion. use this uh, cream cheese you know from from Wally World then I got a couple slices of just white American I got some of this good Havarti couple slices left of that and I got a slice or two left of this Gouda so that's the cheeses that I'm going to use all right so I'm gonna go ahead and let all this cook up and then I'll show you how I stuff the noodles all right you know, I forgot the Worcestershire sauce. You got to have the Worcestershire sauce in anything be. All right, put that in there. I think I'll make a big salad to go along with it. All right, let's turn that down. I think the noodles are about done because they're going to we're going to cook the. All right, I'm going to uh, let's open up this cream cheese. I probably should. Look, well, it'll. I put the hamburger on it. It'll. It'll cool. I mean, it'll start melting. take this uh, white cheese it's just um, just American just white American cheese you know instead of the I get the white I read somewhere one time that the white's better for you than the yellow so I always try to get white cheese when I can um, like you know like American cheese and stuff Uh, I'm just going to cut that up in there. Alright, let's take a slice of Gouda. I like to put different kind of cheeses in it. I don't, I don't know. That's how I roll. So what y'all going to do today on this old nasty snow day? I don't care for it. I really don't. I'm sick of the snow already. Magcap, one of my subscribers, she 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 called it. She said that she wanted some snow to kill all the bugs. Well, honey, I hope all them bugs is dead at your house because I'm pretty sure they're dead at mine if they can live under that snow. So, let's see. And then we, I like Havarti. I like I like Havarti. It sort of tastes like like a different kind of. Um, a little bit like a 
Colby. I used to love Colby, Longhorn Colby cheese when I was little. Oh, Mama, get that stuff. I would, she used to buy it in a block when I was little. I would eat that stuff till I was sick. I still love me some Colby cheese. Okay, so let's see what's going on with this hamburger. Let's go ahead and cut that off. That's a lot of grease because I bought the cheap hamburgers. Why? But you know, we do what we can do. I tell you what. I know I said I'm going to go to Sam's next time and try their dog, but I tell you what, Frost Top has been calling my name. That was the best dog that I've had for a long, long time. Um, Y'all know I love Stewart's. That's my favorite dog. Always has been ever since I was little. I don't know what... Well, to tell you the truth, I, I was... Uh, I just got into, like, eating hot dogs a couple years ago. Usually I was a burger. And everywhere I've ever went, I've just always got burgers. But I don't know. I don't know why. You know, you get old and your taste buds change. Um, and I think, too, I'll tell you why. You know Betty White, the golden girl, Betty White. She says she ate hot dogs all the time and she lived to be almost 100. Plus, let me sit you back here. Um, plus, there was, a, um, there was these two old ladies from Clarksburg, West Virginia. They were called Grandma and Ginga. And they were on YouTube. And if you have never watched them, Grandma and Ginga is Grandma, 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 whatever. Um, they are so hilarious. They're just two old Italian, they're from Italy, but they were, I think, born here. I'm not sure. Um, but anyway, they talk about, they just cuss each other and talk to each other, but they love each other, you know. Um, they've been on the Jimmy Kimmel show, and I think uh, uh, Steve Harvey. I, I heard them one time say they wanted to go on Ellen. I don't know if Ellen ever had them on there. I didn't see it if she did. But anyway, they ate a lot of hot dogs. And I'm thinking, look at all these old people eating hot dogs. <laughs> maybe that's the maybe that's the key to it. You know, maybe. Um, <clears throat> So, okay, look here. Let me give you a good over, overhead shot. Can you see in the bowl? That's without the camera falling off a tripod. Um, okay. So, we got the noodles. They're hot. Okay, so you know what I'm going to do? Um, I'm going to go ahead and let everything cool down a little bit so I can touch it because it's too hot to touch right now. Woo! Yeah, that's too hot to touch. And I'll be, let's th let this cool down and I'll be right back. Okay, everything's cooled down. I'm going to get a smaller spoon. I'm just going to take a, a shell. I stuff mine real good. I put a lot of stuffing in mine. See? I'm going to go ahead and put it in this casserole. I know these are going to be fantastic. Fantastic. Let's put a little bit more in that one. I like to stuff mine. Stuff them full. I probably made too many noodles. That's okay. Because always some of the noodles break. I stuff those anyway, but I'm sure I've, I've made too many noodles because... I don't think I'm gonna run out of I'm gonna run out of stuffing. So they're slippery, slippery little suckers. That one's not pretty, but we'll stick that one in there anyway. 
All right, let's see. We got room for a couple more. Let's stuff this one real good because I'm running out of room. Scoot over, honey. Let's stuff that one full, too. You also won't have to scoot over. Scoochie, scoochie. Let's see. Can I get one more in there? I got a lot of stuff in there, though. Stuff that one real good. <laughs> I'm stuffing them full. Look, I mean, they are full. Let me see if I can't squeeze one more in there because I got. Get all of it and stuff it in this one. This will be a good one. Okay. Let's get it in here. Honey. There. Okay. They're sort of stuffed in there. Let me you see them in there. All okay, so I already showed you. I'm just using the ragu. And then I'm just going to pour it over. Okay. I probably won't use this whole jar because I don't need it. I'll, I'll stick it in there. I still got it like a half a jar. I'll be able to do something with that too. All right. There you go. Mm, I've got the oven set to 350. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and I think I'm going to go ahead and get this bowl out of the way. Go ahead and wash these dishes. Um go ahead and cover it stick it in the oven at 350 um probably for at least a good half hour at least a good half hour i mean everything's done and stuff but you know just so it marinates real good and stuff okay i'm gonna get my mess cleaned up and then i'll be coming back to show you what it looks like okay let's check it and see um i did about 10 minutes ago I did sprinkle some um, Italian blend. That looks pretty good, doesn't it? Let's see. I made me a nice salad. I got uh, what's in there: lettuce, cucumber, onion. Um, I like pickled beets. That's what the red things are, and I think that's it. Okay, let's see how this baby looks. have a plate <laughs> I just wanted to show you all all right so I guess I'm gonna um make me some cheesy bread because you know I can't have garlic anymore and have me a couple of these stuffed shells I'll show you my plate all right YouTube there's my plate look at all the food that I have left over are you okay Frankie I made me an extra piece of cheesy bread for later, and I got plenty of salad for later. All right, I'm going to take one bite of it for you. Mm, I already, you already know it's going to be good. <clears throat> you don't even have to hear me say all of it, but I'm going to anyway. Mmm. Mmm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, that's what we're going to do on a snow day today. See you later, YouTube.